Hey, I'm Jake Crookenden, I'm at Flavor Mag Shoot. Uh, you might remember me from Judges Houses X Factor, where Nicole gave me a custard pie. Uh, I'm now trying to do my own thing, write my own stuff, and just trying to get out there. Recently you're talking things about me. Can you see yourself? I don't care, you down me. Do it on my own, no one else around me. Uh, since leaving, no, I hadn't heard from Nicole. I tried to slip in my number, but she wasn't having any of it. Um, uh, no, I, try, I, I keep in touch with most of them, to be honest. Uh, I speak to Lucy Spraggan, Rylan, uh, speak to James every now and again. Um, but I know that how busy they are. Like, I went to watch the show the other day. I, actually, I'm in contact with Ella quite a lot, because she's only from Grimsby and I'm from Scunthorpe. So. Um, yeah, I, I keep in contact, I try to, but they're busy, they're famous now, aren't they? I'm nobody. <laughs> Uh, I think the right, me, now I think the right person won to be honest, I think James was always going to win. I can remember saying to my mum when I got home after the X Factor, I said there was a guy at boot camp and all my days his voice was unbelievable, I was like I, I probably won't even go back because he's definitely going to win it and he, he ended up winning it. My, um, my girlfriend's dad actually put a tenner bet on him after boot camp because I said he was going to win and he did win and he didn't even give me any money either, it's tight isn't it? <laughs> Um, just go for it and be yourself. If you, if you are going to enter, then the best thing to do is just totally act yourself. Don't try and change because at the end of the day, they'll either like you or hate you. Um, it's, it's just one of those things, you know, like, I think even, I'm not saying I'm good looking, but even if I look like sloth out of Goonies, I think people would still like me, do you know what I mean? Because as soon as your face is on telly, people kind of want to know who you are, which is a bit weird. I just. I just, to be fair, like as soon as a girl starts chatting to me, I just, I'm just polite and I, I, I say, yeah, I've got a girlfriend. And then sometimes it don't bother him, which is quite funny. <laughs> like you, slut. No. Don't forget, brush your teeth. Let me delete that. <laughs> that is horrendous. Oh, wait, let me do my barnet. Wait. Brush your teeth. Right, teeth Did whitening or complete smile yeah. makeover, yeah. Brush and floss them Detecting every mouth day. region. That's my teeth. Uh, quite creamy. <laughs> Hopefully, I will be able to make them whiter. Do you want to show it without my teeth? That's what I look like without teeth. That's shocking. It. <laughs> right. So before, brush your teeth, and then after, brush your teeth. Class. I wish you could do that in real life. I suppose you can if you have false teeth. teeth. <laughs> Right, so it just, it just whitens your teeth. Them, floss them so, floss them high, floss them low. Wow. Floss them to the left. Right, so that quite a nice set of lashes then though. Them, I'm having that. Oh there, look at those burly. And then back to uh, my original. Brush your teeth. My teeth look the same colour as me. Brush your teeth. <laughs> Woolen thing. That is quite a good, that is a class app that you can do that. Brush and then can you save that picture and, and pretend they're your teeth? Uh, hi, I'm Jake Quickenden and I just use Smile Me app and it's class. Brush your teeth. Do you know what I've just noticed? I've got a stamp on my hand from going out the other night. That's disgusting, isn't it? Um, none of them really mean that. that I got a bird, my, um, my little brother passed away in September and um, he, he had a shirt that he always used to wear with birds on. And it really reminds me of him. And um, his, his wife, that he got married when he was 18, his wife kept the shirt and wouldn't let me have it. So um, I got a tattoo of a bird on me, but the rest of them don't really mean, oh, forever as well, that's, that's for my little brother. But the rest of them don't really mean anything. I just literally walk into a tattoo place and get stupid tattoos. I was in, a, I was in Mali and I was reading a magazine and some guy had Forgive Me tattooed down his side, so I, I got it done. And then I actually wrote a song called Forgive Me, so I kind of made up with it for that. <laughs> Everything inspires me. I just, I just kind of want to, I just want to make it so people can listen to what I write about, really. I like writing songs maybe more than I like singing them. So I like to get my own songs out there and, and, and let people think like what the, what the meaning is without explaining it. Wow, first song I've ever bought. It was probably like a Backstreet Boys tune or something like that. Well embarrassing. I did NSYNC, you know, I think it was an NSYNC track. I definitely got NSYNC's album kicking around in my house somewhere. Don't mind the boy band. <laughs> Not like that. <laughs> um, since leaving the show, I, um, I released a song called Mile High that did quite well on iTunes. Um, my second single, Walk Away, has just come out yesterday on iTunes. Um, and I've just been gigging, doing a bit of modelling somehow. 
balaclavas and gloves and that. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to keep my face out there. So. Uh, this is Cuts Like a Knife, it's an original song. I've got a really bad cold. Here we go again, going your own way. Don't need my tempers, I have a ghost. have a number one just a song that I've wrote go to number one I think that'd be absolutely the best feeling in the world and perform bigger events bigger gigs and sell out arenas and stuff like that just I guess the same as everyone really money and all that crap don't really bother me so for me it's just trying to get people to listen to my tracks um, just add me on Twitter at Jake looking in pretty simple just add me on there and, and follow what I'm doing and my YouTube channel is I can't remember what it's called, Jakey Boy 10 I think, so chappy. Um, yeah, so just add me on that and I put my original songs on there and stuff like that. So. And check me out on iTunes, walk away. 
Uh, hi, I'm Jake Crookenden. Make sure you keep it locked to Flavor Mac.